In 1910, Dr. Paul Ehrlich imagined the possibility of being able to fight diseases, cancer, with precision and call the concept magic bullets that could seek out specific harmful cells without damaging normal cells. The immune system defends our body by a synchronous symphony of dedicated immune cells. Antigen exposure leads to B cells producing antibodies that fight against viruses, bacteria, and more, along with other immune cells. Our protagonist is the monoclonal antibody. They're made by injecting antigens into a mouse, leading to antibody production by lymphocytes. And these lymphocytes are extracted from the mouse spleen and fused with tumor cells called myeloma cells. This fusion forms hybridoma cells that can multiply and produce a specific MABs. MABs seek specific antigenic proteins, the epitope is part of the antigen that is recognized by the peritope part of the antibody. See the peritope antibody part attaching to the epitope antigenic determinant on a rogue cell. MABs can flag and trigger cancer cells for destruction, block and prevent cancer growth signals from being sent, help the immune system attack cancer, and help deliver chemo drugs specifically to the cancer cells, making the monoclonal antibody a superstar. There have been hundreds of MABs made, and the utility transcends beyond cancer treatment. They're used in pregnancy testing, osteoporosis, to reduce high cholesterol, identifying diseases, including cancer detection. MABs have given doctors a magical breakthrough for a wide variety of cancers and other conditions, giving a renewed hope to millions of patients. As scientists refine the utility of monoclonal antibodies, the evolution and journey of this remarkable discovery continues on.